Great. I believe we are live! So, hey guys, uh, Mitchell here, and we're playing some more Resident Evil. Let's see if I can remember what the last thing I did was. We got shotgun shells, we got the shield key, which I don't know where it goes yet, so I'm going to put it away. Someone told me to do that, and I would have done it anyway. I, I completely agree. That's what, that's what the strategy is, right? Um, so, I don't think I have anything really new. Uh, that would get me through anything else. Oh, we got the wind crest. That's right. Let's take a look at the wind crest. What does this do? There's an icon depicting wind. Where's the wind coming from? <laughs> it's like a fart. <laughs> hey, buddy, what'd you do with the wind crest? <laughs> Shut up, Beavis. Alright, anyway. Um, let's just move around and see what, uh, what we have to do. Alright, map. We gotta go through those locked doors. So, let's see. I'm trying to think. Oh. <sighs> We need the helmet key. That's what we need. We go back to... We're on the first... This is the first floor of the map. If we go on to the... So we've, we've basically unlocked everything on... Oh, no, 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 we haven't. Okay. So let's go to the second floor of the dining hall and see if we can unlock that door. Sounds good. Did I? I saw my ink ribbon. Urgh. I'm gonna regret having that in my my inventory. Oh, I gotta remember to move the mouse. So yeah, this is where I want to go, and then we go through this door. First one. So yeah, I played the original Resident Evil, and I went to like this area, the top, the top half of uh, the dining hall, and I was like, "Lock from the other side." That was not what I was like. Um, I was like, "Where the hell is the? Uh, where the hell is the second door that's in this uh, this area?" In uh, in the original PlayStation One version, there's only one door in that in the upper floor of the, of the dining hall, which I thought was interesting. I don't think I need those those keys or those uh, those herbs. Let's see what happens when we go through here. Still need to get this. Oh no, never mind. I don't need to get that. Uh, where are we now? Map. Okay, maybe there's a door over here that we can open. Locked. An emblem of helmet. Damn, em hel freaking helmet key. Nope. Hold on. Wait. Uh, this way. So we don't need to go this way. That was an important thing to figure out. We need the helmet key in order we in order to go this way. Right, map. We go through here, we go downstairs. That's not really what I want to do. Yeah, the original is is, uh, is different than the remake. That's I think that's that's interesting, isn't it? Like how different it is. Locked emblem of helmets. So there's also a door I need the, the the helmet key for. Okay. 
Okay. I don't think I need anything out here, right? I mean, it's a shortcut. Not really. Let's go to the other side. <clears throat> but yeah, I, I mean, that's that's interesting, isn't it? Like, how different this remake is from, from the original. Uh, I can't think of, uh, of another remake that uh that put this much effort not only in the visuals but also in you know making making the actual game feel different from from the original despite being the same core game also i i uh i don't know if you guys watched uh, jimquisition but jim had a great episode on how cool the spencer mansion is and uh how much how much we need another uh, Spencer Mansion. It got me thinking, because he was talking about how it, it becomes a a uh, a game environment that you you learn so well and you master and you know all the shortcuts. You know, uh, you, you kind of know it like the back of your hand. Like it, it's almost like returning home whenever you come to uh, you know the the main the main area with that 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 was just in. And I was thinking, like, wow, that's that's kind of like Dark Souls, isn't it? The first Dark Souls. <clears throat> and like, I was like, that it, that explains one of the reasons why, you know, I I feel so so impressed by by this game, playing it now, is because I, I have that same feeling as as I did when I first played Dark Souls, and you know, I, I start to, you know, get get the hang of all these different areas and where all the doors lead and saying like oh well now I have this so now I can go to this area and it's a cool feeling I say that as I wander around helplessly trying to find ways to go and I, I, I'm just finding all the doors with the helmet key so I need to find the goddamn helmet key um, god let's see you know what I could do? There's still that room that I exited really quickly because I was scared of getting killed by those armors. Let's see. Uh, let's let's check out that room because I I didn't really check out much of that room. And while we're here, we'll put away the ink ribbon. Not a single drop of kerosene. <clears throat> Door knob is broken. Do I have any old keys by the I should probably take an old key along with me also. Oh, sorry. I mean, I have the inventory space. I should take an old key along with me. if I need this armor key anymore. I think I might have opened all the uh, all the armor doors. GB1, 3F, 2F. Where am I right now? I'm on first floor. God, I hope I opened all those doors with the key. Oh, I should I should take the key. God damn it. I'm sorry. I should take the key just in case. I don't know for sure if I've if I've uh unlocked all those those armor doors. And you know 
what? I'm gonna put the the shotgun ammo away. I can't imagine coming across something that requires more than six shots with a shotgun unless it's gonna be a boss. And if that's the case, then I'll just uh I'll just die and then go back. I'll know where it is. Alright, so uh let's go up. We gotta make progress. This is ridiculous. Let's just check out this room. I don't remember what the room was where I found Rebecca. Okay, so. Armor guys. Let's take a look at them. The Sleeping Knight. The Sleeping Knight. What's this? There's something in this depression. But the grate is in the way and you can't reach it. That's probably another one of the... Like the the emblems. Oh, here we go. There's something over here. Shield. Lance. Sword and axe, it looks like. There's shield. There's axe. There's sword. And... Mm-hmm. So I guess if we position them... So, it would be shield over, over here to the left. Urgh. How do I... How do I pull? This is not what I want to do. Woe to those who disturb my sleep. There's a switch here. No, don't press it. I can't move these. Like, they're stuck. Let me get out of here. And then come back in. Press the button. Zombie girl kiss, are you crazy? I'll die. I will absolutely die if I press that button. Woe to those who disturb my sleep. There's a puzzle there, and I have to solve it before I push that button. But I can't get behind it, and there's no way to pull. How can I possibly do this? I mean, you see it, right? The uh, shield needs to be on the left, the axe needs to be on the left, sword on the right, and lance on the right. <laughs> should I just, should I just do it and get it over with, kill myself? I mean, I haven't done anything. Let's just do it. We'll push these all in and we'll see what happens. I'm sure it'll be entertaining for, for the people who, wa who are watching anyway. <laughs> Mitch died again. Oh, here we go. Oh, okay. So if we push these in, they come out. What if we? Let's see, shield, axe, sword, lance. What is the connection here? So I pushed that in, and nothing else comes out. What was that? So I pushed in the shield. Pushed in the axe. No, I, pu I pushed in the sword.
All right, I need to come out, come back out of here. I, I obviously am thinking of it wrong. the way I'm thinking about this. So when I push one of them in, usually another one pops out. So, there's a shield, the axe, the sword. There's di they're different colors. Maybe shield and sword are red and axe and lance are blue. Let's try shield and sword. out and I push in shield should put both shield and sword in right yes there we go success please don't kill me yes I'll take the box don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. All right, did it. Oops, I want to examine the box. There must be a way to open this box. There's a switch. Yeah, I'll press the switch. And there's another switch over here. Sunshine will awaken me. Yes. Yes. Ah! <laughs> it appears as if you failed. Alright, let's try this again. That turned on the sun. We need to match that symbol, I guess. Okay, hold on one sec. Let's try this again. Sunshine will awaken me, so we gotta find the two that correspond to the sun. Right? Okay. So that one. That one. Eee! It's a mask. A death mask. Without eyes, nose, or mouth. Okay. It's not a mimic. Stop saying it's a mimic. <laughs> you guys are your goddamn mimics. All right. I want to get to the second floor over here. You see this area with all the red, the locks and stuff? I want to get there. So if I go to the first floor, Get there. That takes me to the third floor, which is not where I want to go. I imagine maybe if I get to the third floor and open that door, that's how I'll get to that area. What about... Let's go back and... To the right. 
<clears throat> Man, this game has no mimics, no vases to break, and no jumps to make. You're right. What a worthless game. This is not where I want to go. Oh, a flash grenade is a defensive item, huh? I didn't know that. <clears throat> By the way, I just want to make my daily reminder that uh, my Patreon is now uh, currently very close to uh, our first goal of 500. You can find a link to my Patreon below the stream, hopefully. Please let me know if it's not there, because that would be Twitch being, you know, Twitch and messing things up. Uh, but I definitely did upload, uh, update it before, before starting the stream. So feel free to check that out. There. Oh, thank you, Zombie Girl Kiss. It's locked. An emblem of a shield. This car oh, shield. Okay, there we go. We have a use for the shield key. All right, progress. Let's make some progress. I'm gonna head back to the. To the box. We're gonna go back inside that. Hold on, well, let's pick up a herb. Why not? We're going back to the box. Yes. Oh, don't worry about it, Grizz, as long as I get to see your wonderful screen name inside uh, some form of chat or comment, uh, I am happy. <laughs> One of these days we're gonna play the we're gonna play a Destiny raid together again. So you can yell at me. Like, damn it, Mitchell, you fucked it up again. <laughs> now we're not gonna be able to get that epic chest. Were you part of that that raid? I don't even remember. Mask without eyes, oat nose, or mouth. Okay, good. So let's get the shield key. I kind of wish, wonder if I can use my survival knife. There, there seem to be cobwebs over there. Uh, I want to see if I can cut those cobwebs. All right, shield key right there. Let's put away the mansion key for or the the armor key for now, and yeah, that should be good. Uh, maybe, yeah, uh, maybe bring some shotgun ammo. Can't imagine whatever is through there will take more than 15 shotgun shells. Put the old key back. If I need an old key, I'll come back here. I'll hold on to the canteen. And, uh, should I get rid of the canteen? Maybe... I mean, it's only one of them. Maybe I'll get rid of the canteen and just take the pistol. Alright. Important decisions in inventory management. Survival knife is a despair net if you if you end ammo, or if you end up with no ammo. There's gotta be another use for the survival knife, right? It can't just be a useless item for dealing with zombies up close. Way. 
Wait, I'm lost. Which way? I go straight. Right. Okay, so I actually have to go through that door. Yes, I'll discard it. Oh, I should have taken the the herb. Now that I discarded that key. Hello. More shotgun shells. Oh my god. It must be my birthday. I'm actually gonna get that herb. comes this way. Well, that's probably going to be spiders, aren't it? Isn't it? It's going to be spiders. Goddamn spiders. Oh, fuck! It's not a spider, it's a fucking snake! Alright. Alright. Get out of here! Woo! Get me away! Ah! Set up, bitch. What's this? Uh, no, not yet. Woo! Ah! How's my health? Poisoned? Oh, no. Uh, I should just use it. <laughs> Where are you going? Where do you think you're going? Not waiting to exhale? Could I have killed that thing? Was I just too bad? Rebecca! Rebecca poisoned! Rebecca, save me! I'm gonna die of poison! I'll be right back. Just hang in there. Do I get to play as Rebecca now? Oh, I get to play as Rebecca! Okay. So I gotta get to there again. I mean, there should be like zero zombies. I mean, it should be a pretty easy run, right? There should be nothing really standing in my way, right? So to get there, we need to go, yeah, through there, and then we go 
through there. Right? Yeah, I remember how to get there. So is this, uh, do you get to play as Rebecca in the, the original version too? It should be this one, right? Yeah, it should be this one. Yeah. Murphy's Law, Mitch. Oh. Don't say things like that. It should be an easy run. There should be nothing that should try to kill me because I've already killed and burned all these fucking zombies. Except for the one that's like over here, and if he comes alive right now, there's gonna be trouble. Ah, oh, got it. Unless, ah, this guy better not turn into a zombie. Okay, he's good. He's good. He's good. Yes, I'll take the serum. This zombie better be chill. It better be chill. Chill zombie. That's a good zombie. It's a good zombie. There better be nothing coming out of those doors. Just fucking run. Just fucking run. We're good. See, because you said Murphy's Law, now I'm expecting bad shit to happen. And I'm, like, freaking out. Oh, God. Gotta get away from that guy. You should Ronaldo the zombies? What does that mean? <laughs> Hurry? No, I mean, there's no way they would have a time limit on this shit. And I'm, I'm going pretty quick. How are you feeling? What happened? What do you mean, what happened? You fought a giant a snake. Poisonous snake and fell unconscious. How does she even know that? Easy. She's been watching my, my screen. Oh, my head's killing me. You should be fine, because I gave you a shot of serum. But again, don't do anything... That you wouldn't do? I'll try to remember that. I owe you one. Bravo, Rebecca. Alright, so let's check the map. So we got two masks. Uh, I need three masks, I think, in order to go down, go back down to the graveyard. Or the crypt or whatever. <laughs> we still need to get... God, I made it in time. All right, that's all for that. Yeah, I'm gonna check this room again. So it's not red, which means I got everything in this room. Go back upstairs, Mitch. Maybe it wants to play again. I just did. And it did not. It's scared of me. Who can blame it? Those three shotgun blasts to the face? I'm sure it didn't feel good. <laughs> 